Hey guys, this is Mainak and you're watching Sales Pro. So this is the ninth part of the lecture of building design using neat apps. So in this particular part, I'm going to show you how to find out the foundation reactions from the analysis results in neat apps, which will help you to design a foundation manually as you might have learned in your course of civil engineering in your BTEC. And also uh, there are some softwares in which you can put these results and design the foundation. So we'll deal about the design of foundations later. In this particular video, we are going to see how to get the force and the bending moment which is required to design our foundation. So let's get started. So this is uh, this was the analysis results here. So first of all, if you want to you know display the reactions over here, so you can just click on display support uh, over this uh, particular icon as you can see, or click on F7, and after this. Uh, make sure you have selected the you know 3d view or the view in which you want to display so uh, we are going looking for you know load combinations here and here comes into account all the unfactored load combinations which you had made for example dl plus ll dead load plus live load and uh, you can just uh, make this plot live in tabulation and which you're interested in that is the force which is coming from z these you know top to bottom and all the moments so if you click on apply you can see the force and the moments here so if we want to find out results in a tabulated form uh, which we can copy for that we can go to our display and then show tables which is in the shortcut you can also get it by control plus t so after this you can go to analysis and you can go to your results and then your reactions and then you can go to design reactions and then click on ok so here there will be a table uh, what you can do is you can expand this particular table and this is the story and this is the joints uh, and and for all this joint there are you know this particular forces so i'll show you how to you know find out the particular thing so suppose this is the joint one or the point one and for this point one what we uh, what you want is this particular load combination starting from this dead load plus live load so this will copy for all the unfactored load combination for the joint one so you can select this and then you can copy this using control plus c and then open excel and then paste it using control plus v so now as you can see these are the you know forces these three and these are the moments mx my and mz so what we are really concerned about here is our fz that is this one so you can delete this uh, two which we don't need and you can just put a command in excel equals to max and uh, just give it a range here and maximum along this and then close the bracket and then just drag this and give it a bold and here this is the maximum shear force which you're talking about for the maximum moment you can just select close to max and that this particular range will be among this three so this is you can just make this back as not bold and this you can make this as bold control plus b it's a shortcut so this is our shear force this 868 kilonewton and this is our moment 25.29 kilonewton per meter which we are going to use for the design of our footing f1 so this is all for the video in today uh, in this lecture we have learned how to find out the support reactions in the upcoming videos we'll show you how to design the foundations so if you like this video drop a heart in the comments and keep practicing wherever you are stay happy